Okay. Now, as I've shown you now, we've started to shape, shape the shoes and started to uh, pretty much get this figure getting close to being finished. Now, as I told you, I drew this line down here on the center between the legs. And when I come up to the where the pants meet uh, with the, well, with the crouch, I would say, I'm going to draw a little line this way, like a little V like there. And let me show you what that's going to do. Take this, dig in, on each side, see what I'm doing? I'm separating the pants legs up here. See that? See that? It's a little V cut right in there. And I separated the pants legs from one another. And I'm going to kind of move a little bit of wood in here, a little bit in here. So I separated those pants from one another is what I did. I'm going to take a little, just a little stuff off here, around this coat just a little bit, kind of go around, rounding it just a little bit, kind of getting it even. Remove a little wood in here just to sort of separate that and give him a little belly. Okay, now I'm going to come up here where the top of the shirt is. I'm going to draw a little line this way, a little line this way. Okay? All I'm doing is I'm, I'm separating, uh, just making a little design on the shirt right in here. You cut like a little V, just like I did there. And I'm going to come from the inside and remove that wood. All that is, just a little design on the shirt, right there. And see, that all that is, just a little V. That's all that is, just to give a little design to the shirt, okay? Now, this figure is almost done. Now, what I want to do, I just want to kind of round off these arms a little bit, get them rounded off just a little bit, as it comes up on the on the shoulders here. See, just sort of going around, rounding them off a little bit. Bring this coat kind of down in the back here. Just just sort of rounding him off a little bit. I know he's a flat plane playing character, but that doesn't mean everything. Okay. Now go to your arms here and Cut your little, cut your couple little V cuts in there. See, right, right here, and like right there. See what that does? It gives it sort of a crease on the where the uh, where the elbows come. Just sort of a little crease right in there, sort of uh, make it look look different. off in here, but we just about got our figure established right here. Like I said, he's not a real difficult figure. There's not a lot of difficult things coming on, uh, not a lot of fancy. Uh, you can put a lot of detail, more detail in the coat and things like that. But let me show you this, something. I'm going to take my V-tool right here. And I'm going to come here with this coat, just to show you, uh, I'm just going to put a few little V's in there, V cuts in there. See, it just sort of looks like the wrinkles in the coat, that's all it does. See that? It just, and, and it's not anything fancy, it's not anything at all, but it just, it just helps you kind of establish uh, 
what you're doing here. And I'm going to clean up this back a little bit. Okay, so you pretty much got your figure here. Now, we've got to finish up a few things, clean up a few things. Now, I'm going to show you something. If you want to make the pants, if you want to just kind of make the pants look kind of wrinkled, all you got to do is just do a few, few little V-cuts like this in the pants, in other words. It makes them look kind of wrinkled. There you go. So you just cut a few little old V-cuts in there, and it makes the pants look like they, they're, they're kind of wrinkled in here. See that? You don't have to do that, but if you want to, that's fine. Where it looks like uh, his pants are kind of drooping. There you go, see? Just a series of little V-cuts that you can do to make them look kind of ragged. Now, I'm going to take my V-tool. Thing, the only thing I have finished up here is I've got to get the hair. And this V2 is a wonderful little old tool. You just get you one, and you get them in all, all carbon supplies. You just sharpen that V2, and look at that. You just start making your hair. Just sort of go around it. See what I'm doing? Come back here. Start making the hair. Take a lot of pressure. Just sort of sort of dig in a little deeper with 